and as you can see from the top right uh, graphics uh, there are two days until the expulsion if I press the square and go to the instant messages everybody's you know telling me to use the calling card there is this conversation on old hey we're now we're sending the calling card we found the treasure so the sooner the better why not meet up with everyone if you're ready so what will it be should we assemble the hideout and send out the calling card what do you think Jay I think it's time to do it although although I would like to actually go shopping and see if I can buy some healing items why not right Perhaps there's still time in the afternoon to go buy something. Let me see. I can go to Ayuyama and then go to... Maybe not Shibuya, but I can go to the doctor, perhaps. Yeah, clinic. One sleeps asleep that knows no dawn, huh? Or at least some good old-fashioned caffeine in my system. Come to think of it, I might collapse again if I take that medicine. I feel like I need bold guts in order to take that medicine. That yellow print there is... That basically means that... That my guts level need to be of bold level. Bold is one status level. some more money so I'm gonna I think I'm gonna use one of these I'm gonna buy one of these items here again perhaps two more yeah why not because this you know being able to heal up 100 HP can really save the game and possibly I'll buy one of these because I'd like to get at least two of them for the situation where one particular enemy is capable of doing that on me and then the revive drain is also very important so I'll really need to use this, at least one. And there it is it. I ran out of money already. Take care. Awful. But you know, not easy. But let's just do it. Now by pressing square, perhaps I can resume already. There you go. Yes, let's meet up. All the little meeting, let's see what they say. Damn it. All right. Hmm, not much to say. I think it's just time to go. Let me just get everything set up. Sorry guys, I'm having my mobile phone. Everybody texting me now? Leave me alone, guys. I want to send a calling card. Okay. Mm -hmm. 
so. I've been waiting to hear you say that. Let's do it! Tomorrow's finally the day. So we send the calling card in the morning and carry out the plan by the end of the day, right? Correct. The effect won't last that long. Are you worried? <laughs> Waited too long. Perfect. Okay, I still don't get the whole thing. Apparently I'm supposed to use the card at which point, um, at which point, well, the day will be reset. I will wake up in the following day and then in the in the course of the following day I'm supposed to deal with it and there is no second chance because the effect of the card will dissipate in the space of 24 hours so that is what I gathered so far of the old calling card mechanism again reading it I'm a bit skeptical that this is really nice because you know in the previous Persona games you would fight and fight stronger and stronger harder and harder all the way up to you know to grinding and to getting to the to the final boss it was like a proper climax instead this calling card it's a bit of a hiccup in the whole process but you know i have yet to experience it from the shoes you know in the shoes of the user so let's do that now going to pull this off no matter what so who's going to write the card Leave it to me! Why? Why? Why wouldn't it be me? Yuji is offering to do it. This is important. Are you sure you can handle the pressure? What do you mean? I must agree. I really want to get him good. You got it, Ryuji. You do it. I'm, I'm happy with you doing it. Kind of makes sense. Yeah, I got this. Cool. Hey, are you sure about this? If they find out our identities, all this work will be for nothing. I know, I know. All right, then. Tomorrow it is. Yeah, okay. So what's actually happening? Not slack off on this. So are we not witnessing the process of Yuji writing the calling card? Well then. Well, whether you like it or not, the real battle begins tomorrow. Better be sure you're prepared, okay? Man, there's so much I want to write on the calling card. It's kind of tough figuring out what to say. Are you sure you're really capable of this? Don't worry, I got it. I even made a logo for us. He made a logo? Damn, he's doing a proper branding of the whole thing. Yep, you'll get to see tomorrow. Well, that's worrying. You guys should rest up. If we screw up tomorrow, we're totally done for. Guess they're like, huh? That's... That's really defeating. I'm counting on you guys.
prepared. Hmm? You seem different. Do they always have that scowl on your face? Do you always have that? Nothing goes your way in life. You'll end up failing if you dance up like that. Dude, just leave me alone. Save the studying for later. Tomorrow's the day of the heist. Haste? Sorry, haste, perhaps. You know? Yeah, yeah, okay, okay. Let's go sleeping. I wanna watch TV for a second. Led by a mysterious figure. The, fa the feather men unite. However, their memories have been stolen. Is there any way they can regain their lost memories? Revive and fight, Phoenix Rangers. Next episode. Don't take three steps. You lose your memories. <laughs> Power Rangers were like that. You always had the situation where these guys were in such a dire, I don't know, dire defeating premise where they would be just, I don't know, completely lost and then they would turn it around in the more, in the most questionable way. Not questionable, but improbable. Do I need to use the work desk? Let's see. I see. Let me get the lockpick done, at okay. least one, because you never know. I may be able to find some random chest at the last minute. What are you and we're ready to take on our first boss of Persona 5. Exciting. Hmm. What else can I do? Well, let's just make one of these things. I wasn't even sure what it does. A deodorant that erases your presence, lowering a palace security level. Well, I'll make one. Since I'm doing stuff, I might as well build something. It may even work in my favor by increasing my proficiency with crafting things. Let's see. You're definitely getting better. I can tell just by watching you. Yeah. Ooh. Hmm, I'm proficiency level 2, that is the one that I have been working on the most, the only one that got to level 2. Uh, as you can see from the logo of the stars, there are up to 5 levels. It gets increasingly more difficult to level up, as you can imagine, but you know, that's the spirit of the grind. All right. Your, prof your proficiency has increased to decent. Well then. Let's go to bed. Headed was already posted by the time everyone go here in the morning. Sir Suguru Kamoshida, the utter bastard of lust. Wow. <laughs> that is forward. We know how shitty you are, and that you put your twisted desires on students that can't fight back. That's why we have decided to steal away those desires and make you confess your sins. Yeah, sounds good. It sounds riot. This will be done tomorrow, so we hope you will be ready. From the Phantom Thieves of Hearts. Oh, you know what? This riot feeling and this sort of disobedience, social disobedience and this mood of revolution i really like it wow i'm a bit of a punk perhaps well i am in real life so yeah not bad eh i must say though the students are so elegant like this cool uniform this school uniform are 
You know what? I will be happy to go to school. These kids are so well dressed. I looked up a bunch of similar stuff online for reference. Yeah. Um, yeah. Some guerrilla stuff. I know what you wanted to say, but it sounded like an idiot trying to be an adult. It's <laughs> kind of what it is, yeah. Your logo's a little lacking, too. I liked it. Okay, you know what? That ain't true. Did Mr. Kamashita do something wrong? Does this mean the rumors are true? Ooh. The rumors are getting some weight. Wait a sec. Is someone gonna take something from Mr. Kamashita? What's with this weird logo? <laughs> and who are these phantom thieves of hearts people? It got everyone excited, so it's all good, yeah? Well, you can't blame Ryuji. I mean, the, the whole stunt its definitely getting some momentum. <sighs> Who's responsible for this? Look at that. A predictable reaction for someone who knows what we mean by distorted desires. I think it's hitting him pretty hard. Did you do this? Or was it you? Ooh, snapping. He's losing it. Was it you two? What are you talking about? So you're playing dumb? <laughs> it's not a problem. You'll be expelled soon enough anyway. Come, steal it if you can. What? Judging from Kamoshida's response, I'm sure we had an effect on his palace. Does that mean the treasures appeared? We'll be able to get it today, right? It's not just today. It's only today. The impact of seeing a calling card doesn't last long, and it cannot be repeated. This will be our one chance to steal the treasure. One day's more than enough for us. Ah, uh, the no man. The calling card has been delivered to the target. You can now enter their palace and steal the treasure within. So the old palace alert system went up to 99%. And I wonder what implication that will bring. Well then. Level 10. I don't think I need to really do anything else. What I'm gonna do is to go directly to the throne room and try to get to the, you know, to the end of it. Let's go! Is there an enemy around? The enemy is not here, but the doors are open. Come on, man. What the hell's going on here? The door's just sitting open. And there aren't any soldiers around. This place is probably undermanned now. But they all got as that they all mm, they all got assigned elsewhere. Either way, we win as long as we can steal the treasure. Let's keep going. That was strange. I don't know, I expect enemies to just jump up. That didn't happen. No enemies jumped up. And there doesn't seem to be any enemies behind this computer. So I think we're ready to go in a statue. I 
Are you guys enjoying the new different soundtrack here? Nice soundtrack. I'm ready for the fight. desires T treasure uh the cat's acting awfully excited what's wrong is something morgana is losing it Yeah, calm down. Calm down. All right, that's enough, you stupid cat. <clears throat> oh, um, yeah. Forgive me for displaying such an insolent sight in front of a lady. You were completely out of character, too. What was that about? I couldn't stop it either. To think I'd be drawn to human desires this much. That's one creepy cat. <gasps> Doesn't that prove that I'm human? Hmm. Hmm. How should we know? Uh, anyway, you guys need to carry it. All you do is bark orders. Still, that was easier than I thought. I thought for sure there'd be some insane trap or something. This palace will disappear if we take this back, right? And Kamoshida will change too. That should be the case. So, I'm really... So, what is going on? Like, isn't there a boss? Is this it? Is it only just a matter of coming here to the location and taking it? It can't be. Surely I need to confront him somehow. Good. Now's our chance then. To think it'd go so well. I've even found three Persona users in the process. My judgment was correct. I made the right choice in making a deal with you. I feel like my bond with Morgana is growing deeper. Oh wow. Cool. So Morgana is now also capable of receiving and passing the extra, the, the one plus turn with the baton pass ability. And she's now rank two, which means that if I create, uh, if I create the persona of the magician Arcana, then I will be receiving bonus XP point um, equivalent to level 2, you know, it's basically a boost of rank 2. All right. You will now earn more XP from Arcana Burst when, when fusing Personas of the Magician Arcana. Morgana can now use Baton Pass. Legs. I will let anyone take this. It's a lot smaller. This proves that I am the king of this castle. It is the core of this world. Hmm, so the treasure maybe tends to be the core of the whole illusion. That rat bastard. That's how he sees me, isn't it? Yep. 
You only get it now, and Yo, pervert! Were you waiting to ambush us? I just made it easier to find you. I'll dispose of you myself. Right here, right now. That's our line, you sexually harassing D-bag! What a selfish misunderstanding. How is it a misunderstanding? You were doing things that you kept in secret from others. People around me were the ones who kept it secret. Adults who want to share in my accomplishments. Students who have the drive to become winners. They willingly protect me so that we all may profit from it. They willingly protect me? I don't know. I don't know. Profit? There are too many imbeciles who don't understand that. Including naive brats like you and that girl who tried to kill herself. True, she's a total idiot. Letting you manipulate her, trying to commit suicide. Wow, what is the, what is the victim blaming going on here? I'm even more of a dumbass for not realizing that. But no matter what kind of fool someone might be, they don't need your permission to live their lives! Drop the attitude, you mediocre peasant! There is no wrong in using my gifts for my gain! I'm a cut above all other humans! Above? You mean beneath? You're a goddamn demon obsessed with your sick desires! <laughs> I think he's about to transform or something like this. That's right. I'm not like you. I am a demon who rules this world. Demon voice. What the hell? <laughs> Big. I'm allowed to do whatever the hell I want. <laughs> Look at the eyes. <laughs> the eyes are really funny. He's got like his eyes all running around and <laughs> his eyes are all disjointed and not, you know, coordinated and he's having a glass of wine on his hand, his tongue sticking out. He's got a knife on one arm as well. And I don't know what else it is that he's got on his left arms. And it's gonna work. But yeah, nice drawing. What's happening? Ooh, let's see. Let's see what he is like. You goddamn no good shitty brats! Haven't you been just not the point of people? Huh? Right, he's got four arms, so that may suggest that he's going to do physical attacks because having so many arms, perhaps he's gonna try and be physical. Plus, he's a is a sportsman, so is he's not gonna be particularly strong and magic attacks. Look, the treasure's over there. What well, the the crown? We should catch him off guard and steal it. What really? Let's attack him and wait for that opportunity! An opportunity to catch him off guard to steal the treasure? How about we just defeat him? Fine. The game's so complex. take on Kamoshida himself! Everyone, let's do this! Sugu Am Asmodeus Kamoshida. Okay. He seems to have quite a few... No, sorry, those, those things there are normal. I was just not recognizing the the two statistics next to the wind. There are two statistics that I'm not very familiar with. Perhaps I'm just wrong. They've always been there. I don't know. I have the impression that those purple and light blue stats 
those icons there. They are kind of new, I haven't seen them for other enemies. I might be wrong. So what do I do? Persona! If I use this one, I could perhaps try to increase my defense, or perhaps the safe thing to do is to decrease his attack, because as I said, you may try and do a physical attack. There. Cool. His attack went down. Persona! I can increase my own attack. Let's see what happens. Let's try with wind, just because you never know. Quite a lot, quite a lot of damage done. Let's try with Agi. Hmm. Ooh. It's a good thing that I have decreased this attack uh, power. Try with a physical attack. I'm not done. There. Ooh, pretty good. Let's try with Zio. You never know. He's not weak to that. Ooh. Let me try to get him asleep. I'm not sure it will work though. Missed. Ooh, beautiful. Missed. Very smooth. Again. Ten. That's fine. Persona! Let me increase my own defense for three turns, just because I don't want to be caught off guard if he pulls off some sort of extra strong attack. Persona! Let's go with the physical. Round 45. Just in case, let me heal her up. Yeah, just healed himself. He pretty much has nullified whatever damage I had dealt to him. That that's rude. He healed himself. Is it because he ate those inside there? Let me try and decrease his attack for more turns. Let's go with a physical attack. So we haven't learned anything about ice, but I don't think that would work particularly. Let's try with a physical attack. 60. Mm. Good thing I have increased my defense. Let's go. I'm not done. Go down. Oh, I can hit that thing. You don't know what this is for, so stop touching it. Don't do it anymore. Got it? I'm warned. 
Ooh, okay, so that's where I need to attack. I need to try and steal his food so that he won't heal back again. When someone tells us not to do something, it makes us want to do it even more. That's right. Persona! Let's try with a physical attack. I mean, with a magical attack on that thing. Ooh. Leave it a boost. Oh, hell, he just healed himself again. Hmm, don't worry, you won't. We won't last if we leave that trophy be. Okay, I get it. I get it now. Persona! Let me increase my own defense first. Persona! Heal Huji. Sorry. Go! And let me heal Joker. Hello Diogo, welcome to the stream man. How you doing? By the way, I'm very sorry to hear about the fires in Portugal. Kamoshida is staring at Anne for some reason. I wonder why. Let me try the double fangs on him. attack let me decrease his attack all right Persona! there we go let me heal her uh, that's a big help and now let me heal myself but if I heal myself ah! you never know Five, that's good. Ooh, missed. Defense reverted. I want to increase my defense nonetheless. But I tell you what. Might as well attack. No, 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 no. I need to be careful. Let me increase my defense. down on everyone but you're seriously lame right now 
We came all this way to steal that. Will you just give it up and hand it over? Silence! I will let the likes of you have this! You still have the energy to say things like that? Then we're going to up our game as well! Let's go! Won't get anywhere with brute force. In certain battles, you will be able to carry out special orders. If this strategy succeed, the flow of battle would turn greatly in your favor. Be sure to choose the party member you feel that has the best chance of success. However, keep in mind that this party member will act separately, meaning you will have to fight with one fewer party member for a period of time. I don't get it. Like, I need to give him special orders. How do I go back to the previous? What do we do? Let's go for the crown. We should take the treasure. Isn't that like saying the same thing? That's like saying the same thing, isn't it? I see. In that case, look over at that terrace. While the others are drawing Kamoshida's attention, have someone go there. Let's steal the treasure without him noticing. What's the best I need to split the party. How do I do it again? Order. How do I decide what to send? No, not gonna do it. I'm just gonna attack. Even not even that, I'm just gonna save a huh? healer in that case. crown from him we need to steal Kamoshida's treasure should I send someone to do it fine let's do it I can go whenever you want time to show you my skills Ugh, gross he keeps looking at me I'm gonna send Anne because she's the least effective in physical contact I mean in, in physical combat and and You know, this going to she's work? fit, so I'll send her. Roger. Attack Kamoshida. Keep him busy. It's time. Let's go. Big guns? What does that mean? <laughs> He's living in a nostalgic delusion. Kill 
Feels like he's gonna hit Keep your guard. Let me decrease his attack. He was staring at me. Oh yeah, perhaps it wasn't the best idea to send her because he was gonna keep his eyes on him, on her. Hey, shouldn't I stay here? Yeah, you know what? You stay here because you're way too, how can I say, visible. Yeah, okay, let's take the treasure, but time to show you my skill. I'm gonna send Morgana. To keep him distracted by attacking him. Smart decision. Attack Hamoshida. Keep him busy. Oh, I can see Morgana there in the corner behind the statue. What do I do? I just attack. Zona. I could probably heal though. I should really try and heal somebody. Maybe I can... Calm down. Use something that restores HP to all allies. Don't I have anything like that? Let me just restore 50 HP at least. Oh, that's a big help! attack let me try and get him down welcome to the stream everyone good to see you guys I'm trying to get Kamoshida to you know, there's a render. Oh, he seems to be annoyed. Kind of feel for him. It's all going as planned. Time to use this opportunity to take the treasure. Do you think it's going well? Okay, it seems that I have chosen the right person in the party to send in this diversion plan the diversion plan is having morgana as you can see hanging for the the little cat is literally clinging from the ceiling there and it's trying to hook to grab the balcony go up there from the balcony and steal the crown from up there in the meantime i am supposed to just survive and keep on going while the three of us keep fighting so i'm gonna have to heal myself preventively just you never know I always try to make sure that I am in abundantly in good health because if I die, Kamoshida stirs at hand. Okay. That confirms that he hasn't paid attention to Morgana on the balcony. So I say why not attack him? Right? I ran out of SP points. That's ridiculous. Good. <laughs> the developers have really decided to take along the the theme of sexuality 
in the first boss. They really didn't wait for this one. They didn't go with the tame boss about, you know, flowers and, and the evilness. You know, they, go with, they went with sexual kinkiness for the first boss. I find that quite brave for the Western market, at least. But, you know, it works. It makes you care for some reason. They came on to me. He hasn't noticed a thing here. Good. Just a little more to the treasure. What the persona? Let me just attack. And let me heal him, because he's been spending his own HP points. Lick, oh, ew, disgusting. Attack Hamoshida! Busy. Copy on. Let me try and heal her. Hmm. Before it is too late. Thanks! Persona! Let's go. Uh oh, he noticed something. It's already check and me. Uh oh. Got the treasure out of him. Good. Kamoshida's shaking up. I think we can do this. Oh, man. Sorry, I'll try not to comment. Persona! Well, I think this time we go heavy endedly on him. Six. Kamoshida seems dejected. Persona! Hmm. There we go back into this. Let's go with a double attack. Come on, we got it. Persona! Let's go. Yes! It's done, guys! Eight thousand yen, four hundred fifty XP points. Awesome. Dang, everybody at level eleven. That is gorgeous. Awesome. I leveled up. Next level in only two hundred seventy points. That's pretty good. even stronger my max HP and SP went up I can now create personas up to level 11 and that's actually pretty good because if I remember correctly there are a few interesting ones that I might be able to create now you move. what do you think oh awesome so the cap the skull skull sorry that's his character name skull which is Gyuji uh, his persona has acquired a new skill. The next new skill will be at level 14. At bot will allow me to deal a medium physical damage to one foe, but that will cost me 16 HP, so I'll have to deal that carefully. There is a medium chance of forget. That's good. That's really good. Oh, now that's convenient. Media is a slight HP recovery to all allies. Really good to have. And Carmen uh, learned Tagunda, which is the decrease of attack. Very useful against the new enemies when they when you don't know how powerful they might be. Awesome.
<gasps> he called it back. Look at him go. What's wrong? Not running away? Why don't you run? Aren't you a great athlete? Ooh, she's dazing him. It's always been like this. All those goddamn hyenas forcing their expectations on me. Look at that illustration. If I'm not wrong, that illustration there with the crazy eyes, that's new. I haven't seen that before. I'm doing this all for them. What's wrong about demanding a reward for that? Oh. Now you're making excuses? We'll do something about that distorted heart of yours. <laughs> Scared? Right now? You're seeing the same view that Shiho did. I'm sure she was scared too. Except she had no choice but to jump. What will you do? Will you jump? Or would you rather die here? Want to finish him off? It's your call. No, please wait. I beg you. Just forgive me. Shut up. I bet everyone told you the same. But you, you took everything from us. No! I, I accept defeat. You want this? Take it. Uh, go ahead and finish me off. You do that, and my real self will go down too. You have that right, since you've won. <laughs> On! If his mind shuts down, he can't admit his crimes. You're kind, Lady On. I've lost. You're through when you lose. What am I? What am I supposed to do now? Ooh, that's nice. Uh, figure it out yourself? No, 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 no. We're gonna take him by the hand and have him come to the realization that he's responsible for his actions. So he's got a tone for his mistakes. Alright. I will leave now and return to my real self. Just so you know, we don't have time to wait. This place is about to collapse. Anime. Run! Awesome! Did you guys see that? <sighs> that sucked. We're back in the real world. <gasps> Look at the nav! The destination has been deleted. It's true. We can't go there anymore. What about the treasure? A medal? Oh, wait, where'd that crown go? What's going on? Yeah, where's the crown and what, what's with the medal? It means that was the source of Kamoshida's desires. What? To him, this medal is worth as much as that crown we saw in the palace. 
So there is a physical, like in real life, correspondent to the treasure that is so sought after in the palace. That is so, that is so obscure, really. I think they've done a bit too much in this game. Compared to the previous Persona games, perhaps it's a bit too obscure and it's a bit too abstract sometimes. An Olympic medal. So, that perv kept clinging to his past glory and couldn't let it go. But... This means that Kamoshida's heart might have changed, right? Probably. Our expulsion's on the line here! This is the first successful example for me, too. However, there's no doubt that this has affected Kamoshida's personality quite a lot. The entire palace disappeared, after all. That's right. It has disappeared. Uh, I feel all antsy. Ain't there a way to check now? I'm personally worried. This all seemed like some sort of big dream. We'll just have to wait and see Kamoshida's next move. Come on, why the gloomy faces? Be happy! We completed this with great success, you know. Hmm. We just don't know if everything's okay yet. I'm pretty sure it'll be fine. Remember how Kamoshida's shadow said that he's returning to his self in reality? Perhaps the shadow part is now going to be, you know, the shadow part that is now sorrowful and has realized this mistake is going to go back and reunite with the in real life personality of Kamoshida, making him be more understanding of his mistakes. I don't know, I don't know. Again, I'm speculating. This game is massive. Whatever, I'm kind of giving up. Suguro Kamoshida was a scum. I mean, I probably just need a few more bosses and a few more enemies, a few more palaces, a few more of these things in a pattern, and then I will like, realize and understand precisely what is going on with the story of this game. Still, he did seem to regain his conscience somewhat at the end. It did seem so. There are definitely those who have been saved, thanks to what you've done. Yeah. Anyways, I guess we gotta wait. It all boils down to what's gonna happen to Kamoshida. Or if we're getting expelled for real. Yeah, I think we gotta be patient. Yeah. Let's go. Cool, cool, cool. Hey! Don't worry, I'm sure the change of art worked. The board's meeting tomorrow, right? We're gonna get expelled if Kamoshida doesn't have a change of art by then. Uh, we did all we could. Let's chill. <laughs> Let's put our legs up, everything's fine. Either way, I'm not going to lose hope. You're right. It'll be a little too early to be giving up now. Guess we're gonna find out one way or another tomorrow. We just gotta brace ourselves for all the possibilities. Sorry. I can't offer more reassurance, but he should have the change of heart. Let's just believe in that while we wait for tomorrow. <sighs> I don't know, that big sign saying that there is only one day left, that's kind of making me fret now, but... Hey. Working while tired won't get you too far. Okay, I can't study, I can't do much, I can only get asleep. Oh, so Jigo seems to have customized this conversation based on, you know, on the outcome of today and they're saying you sure look satisfied if something good happened nothing goes your way in life let it get to your head and you'll get the rug pulled from under you yeah, 
weather. It's been three weeks since the tragic subway disaster. In the course of addressing the accident, the Minister of Transport ended up resigning. Many questions, however, still remain unanswered, as police struggle in their investigation. The accident happened right after you moved here to Tokyo, didn't it? Yeah. Right. Right. Hey. Let's go to sleep. Let's see what that what happens tomorrow. Let's see what tomorrow brings. The use of shades of white and bl and black and the use of red as the only color is, is so pretty. Anyway, Mondays are such a drag. Why couldn't they give us off too? Today off too. We have the rest of the week off starting tomorrow. Yeah, it's ridiculous. Speaking of, what's up with the calling card? The one sent to Kamoshida. Didn't it say something about stealing is the store to desires or something weird like that? Yeah, something like that. I'm sure it's just a prank. No one's taking it seriously. Unless... Hey everybody, welcome to the stream. Make sure to leave a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you like. There is a whole playlist of this. Morning assembly. What's with the sudden morning assembly? Oh, I bet it's about that girl that jumped the other day. They don't have to tell us not to commit suicide. There was that weird calling card too, so I guess the teachers are freaking out. We're lucky that morning practice got... Maybe. I feel like I'm gonna faint if this takes forever. <sighs> and looks disheartened. Let's begin this school-wide morning assembly. As you all know, a tragic event took place the other day. This is the principal of the school, if you don't know it. Thankfully, we have been informed that she has pulled through, but it will take time until she recovers. Everyone here has a bright future ahead. I implore that you rethink the importance of life and... What's he going on about? <laughs> Mr. Kamashita, what's the... I... have been reborn. Ooh. It doesn't look like the usual self. That is why I will confess everything to you all. Huh? What's wrong with Mr. Kamoshida? What's this about? It's happening. Team do something. I have repeatedly done things that were unbecoming of a teacher. Verbally abusing students, physically abusing my team, and sexually harassing female students. I am the reason. Why Shiho Suzui tried to kill herself. Sexual harassment? What? Why would he say that? Uh, he is the so first. Really? Physical abuse? That's quite public. I thought of the school as my own castle. There were even students that I sentenced to expulsion simply because I didn't like them. I will, of course, rescind those. I am truly sorry for putting innocent youths through such horrible acts. Oh. I am an arrogant, shallow, and shameful person. Yeah. I'm worse than that. Kind of sorry now. Sorry to seem so beaten up. I will take responsibility. I kill myself for it. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. That's may that perhaps is taking it a bit too far. What? The principal just finished talking about valuing your own life, Mr. Is... and now he's looking around for sort of Mr. Kamoshida, validation. Please get off the stage for now. <laughs> please get off the stage. You're embarrassing me. Everyone, return to your classes! Don't run, you bastard! 
Shio's still alive, even after all the things that made her want to die. Yeah, you tell her, Anne. You have no right to run from this! You're right. You're absolutely right. I should be punished under the law and atone for my crimes. I did horrible things to Takamaki-san as well. In return for giving Suzui-san a position on the team, I... I tried to force her into having relations. Well, you know, some may say that was just sort of a friendly offer, you know. It's, it's okay, no, forget it. For a position on the team? It feels so That's bad horrible. So the rumors son. weren't true. As of today, I will resign from my position as an instructor and turn myself in. Someone, please call the police! Okay, it's flipped out completely. The police? Is he for real? He's gonna get wow. arrested? Yeah, right? This morning's assembly is over. Return to your classes immediately! Isn't this just like what that calling card said? Yeah, people are, you know, joining the dots. Does this mean the Phantom Thieves thing was for real? Was something done to Kamoshida? Come on, there's no way you could steal someone's heart. But why else would he start saying things like he'll kill himself or turn himself in? Maybe because it almost got leaked? Don't they go easier on you if you turn yourself in? Ooh, everything is gaining momentum. I wonder what happened. Who knows? <laughs> but man, Kamoshida turned out to be one sick bastard. Damn right. Hey, is this for real? He's turning himself in just like that? What's going to happen this to the boys? Is this going to be a big... Return to your classrooms at once! Nobody paying attention. His heart really did change. Yeah, I got a trophy. Castle of Lust Falls. Castle of Lust? Castle of Lust Falls. His heart. His heart really did change. Seems like it. But was this really for the best? Well, I mean, we couldn't just tell him to take it easy. He had crossed the line, he had stepped over the line way past the line. The line was a dot to him. So, so you know, it was kind of for the best for all future generations. Yeah, have you, Kamoshida? You mean the police stuff? Well, that's true. Huh? What the? Takamaki-san, I'm sorry. Huh? We all knew, but we pretended we didn't. Oh. That's. That's. Nice. Finally, someone coming out of our from under the carpet. Takamaki-san, I had you all wrong. I'm sorry that I spread rumors about you. You shouldn't spread rumors. You know that. You should confront problems instead of like going behind people's back without even certifying that you had the right information. You bitch. I didn't know at all. Oh, Kamashita was forcefully pushing himself on you. It must have been so hard for you. I'm sure there's a ton of people who want to apologize to you. We're so sorry. Well, your apologies mean nothing. No, it's okay. The same goes for me, too. How do you mean? Besides, that's all in the past now. Hey, you there! Return to class at once! Who is this guy? This looks like the mayor from Family Guy. Well, see you later then. I can't apologize enough for what I did to you. I swear I'll make it up to you someday. What did he do? Just ignoring me? And not standing up against Kamoshida with us? The only one that had a change of heart. Yeah, right? That's magic. 
Everybody realized they were on the wrong side of the story. Man, I'm glad for you. Looks like those weird rumors are gonna go away. My thing doesn't really matter. We made Kamoshida apologize about Shiho. That's more than enough for me. That's right. You should hurry and tell her about it then. Yeah. Oh, that put a smile on her face. I totally freaked out. He really did have a change of heart. Yeah, that was a bit freaky. The whole scene was a bit, you know, quite public and quite out there. And we were lucky his mind didn't get messed up either. <laughs> this was an A-plus job. Yeah, that's true. And that illustration seems to be new. Does this mean that they won't have a mental shutdown even if their palace disappears? I see. So we need to persuade the shadow without killing it, and then send it back to its real self. Mm-hmm. Our targets won't undergo a cognitive collapse if we do that. That seems to be the case. So we can get him to confess with no bad stuff? In a nutshell. Hey, that works for me. Do you have to be so loud? Mm -hmm. Party pooper. Eh, don't worry about it. So, how'd it go? With Shiho, I mean. She's regained consciousness. Awesome. For real? It was only for a little bit, but I got to talk to her. I was able to tell her that Kamoshida admitted to what he did. Oh. Shiho, she... She told me she was sorry. Looks like she found out that I was flirting with Kamoshida for her sake. Oh. Well, you kind of should stop prostituting yourself for your friends. And here I was, wanting to apologize to her. Kamoshida's at fault for all this. I know. Shiho's mom is thinking of transferring her to another school after she recovers. Hmm. The whole sexual harassment and attempted suicide. People will label her after that. Yeah, that tends to happen. Sounded like Shiho had the same idea too. Ah, it's gonna get lonely. But I think it's for the best. I'm sure it'll be hard if she stays here. That's right. She's alive. You can see her anytime. I need to change too. That aside, I was surprised you could hold yourself back against Kamoshida's shadow. It wasn't like that. I just wanted Kamoshida to apologize himself. You're so kind, Lady On. No matter how much of a shitbag he was, finishing him off would have left a bad aftertaste, huh? I suppose. Huh? That's not it. No? I think revenge is better served if I make him repent. Realizing what he's done, he'll grovel for forgiveness the rest of his life, you know? Wow, she's evil. She's true evil. I just believe there are fates worse than death. Holy shit. I know, right? That's super sexy, isn't it? Uh, anyways, that's all settled. But, you know, there was one more thing I was wondering about that castle. Why was Kamoshida the only one who had that metaverse thing? What do you mean? It isn't necessarily limited to him. It's something anyone could have if their heart became warped from their desires. Anyone. Well, I mean, this open up, opens up to the possibility that everybody in the school is. And that's, you know, that's a bit crazy. Clearly, there has to be a more 
you know, circumstance, a situation that defines who can create a palace with the fabrication of his mind. Wanna check it out? Not right now. We better lay low for a while. People are still gonna be talking about Kamushida. Then again, it's totally impossible for someone to find out what we did at his palace. That's right. Or at least that's what we think. Yeah, about that, weird rumors about you guys are already going around. We're popular, yeah. We're like a boy band, but not cool. Stuff like you got together and threatened Kamoshida with something close to physical violence. The hell? Hmm. <laughs> People aren't going to easily believe that phantom thieves really exist. Calling cards being treated like it was a prank by someone who knew what Kamoshida was doing. Hmm. Hmm. Makes sense. We're the ones who did it, and I still don't completely believe it myself. Right. <laughs> Let's wait for things to settle down for the time being. Anyways, let's check how much this metal can be sold for. It'd be better if we pawned it off ASAP. Ooh, got a hit! Wait, 30,000 yen? That's all a gold medal's worth? Remember that time in middle school? I lent you some money. There's no way I borrowed 30,000 yen from you. Wouldn't it be around that much with compounded interest? That's right. Interest my ass! Dude. I'm not saying that I'm taking all of it. I mean, it's your fault for not paying me back all these years. It's just common sense. She does have a point, and plus she makes a display of this trait that Japanese women have of controlling their finances. Ah, damn it. Over their husbands. <laughs> Commonly. I agree on laying low and keeping an eye on the situation. However, you dragged me into this. It would be nonsense not to celebrate a successful mission. I guess we could blow this dirty money on something fun. Hey. Discussions among phantom thieves are to take place over luxurious food. How about it? Yeah. Hey, wait! Ah, uh, I guess it's fine. There's somewhere I want to go then. Where's that? It's a place Shiho and I have been wanting to go for a while. I owe money, so I can't complain. You good with that? No, let's enjoy ourselves. Let's go out. I'll leave it to your discretion as well, Lady On. I'll call and check the prices later then. When should we go? Want to do it soon? Like, tomorrow? Why don't we go on the last day of the holidays? Hmm. Fine. It'll help energize us when school life starts up again the day after. Then, uh, the 5th, on Children's Day. Beautiful. So, who's going to sell this? How do you mean? Oh yeah, we need to go and fetch some cash. We that'll buy anything. Don't we? Okay, I'll leave that to you guys. And Kamoshida is done. Done and dusted. Ah, you're back. And possibly in prison. Is that gold medal real? When did it get inside his palace? I don't think that's it. No, that one is a fake. It's just a byproduct of his cognition. The real medal should still be in his possession. Really? Well, you're telling me Kamoshida still got the medal? Who cares? What matters is that we changed this art. And anyway, if we had taken the real thing, that would be stealing. I mean, you're a thieves, right? You're thieves. What the... Anyway, I don't think you'll be proud of that matter anymore regardless. You let go of stuff pretty easy, huh? Wanna forget about my debt? That's different. 500 yen is a lot of money for a middle schooler, you know? 
do you even still have that dolphin anyway? Dolphin? Uh, stop, stop digging that up. Embarrassment. Back in middle school, we went on a field trip to the aquarium. But Ryuji had to, sp had to spend all his money on a souvenir, so I lent him some for the train fare. I said I was sorry, that was for my mom. Well, I guess I can call it even after all, after all we've been through. Thank you. Anyways, we don't gotta worry about selling that medal off if it's a fake. End of story. Yes. Kamushida will never be proud of that once in a lifetime gold medal ever again. Depending on how much, on how you look at it, that punishment might be even worse than death for him. <sighs> Must be nice to have so much time off starting tomorrow. For me, it just means more customers and even more work. Well, and at least you may break even, you old lazy bum. No matter what you gonna, no matter where you go during Golden Week, it's packed with office workers on vacation. Why does everyone here have to take a break at the same time? Let's, uh, let's check these items and see what happens to payphone. Hmm, why would you use this thing in this day and age? You know what? I actually wonder the same thing. The store sofa is pretty old, but it's been wiped down nice and clean. Anyway, do I need to sit down? If I study here, I could probably improve my knowledge. Now listen up. You won't have much time for studying when you go out into the world, so study now while you can. Should I study? Perhaps I can do some training instead. Hey, that's a ma magazine over there. Should I do anything with that? Admit it, you were the scene of the crime when it happened, weren't you? I have an alibi. I was nowhere. N I was nowhere near there. I wasn't even close enough to hear the gunshot. Funny, I never mentioned anything about the gunshot. Du -du -du. This is a cop drama, right? It's pretty interesting. Let's go upstairs and see what we can do. Perhaps we can do the training thing or the cleaning. Let's have a look. What's up here? Houseplants. We thought it looked nice, but it looks a bit dead. Don't they sell nutrients or something that will bring some color back to it? That's right. Shelf. Mm. These huge shelves are nice and all. It would be nicer though if we had something to put on there. Right. Table. Uh. Don't even have a TV in your room. Wow. What a huge cardboard box. There's stuff in there. Hey. Now we know we can make them have a change of heart. Well, as long as we don't mess up, right? I was wetting bullets when Ann almost finished them off, though. Yeah, that was tense. I say we do some training, guys. Oh. In the mood to do some training? Training in your room will cost time to pass, but will raise your maximum HP. Oh, that's good. The more you train, the greater the effect will be. Check your schedule and use your time wisely. Okay. That's good. Let, let's do it. Why not? Yes! Cool. Without further ado, let's begin your training. This. Clear your mind and focus on your center. Don't give up. Push past your limit. Hey! Yeah, you're right. You haven't built up much muscle, so don't push yourself. Nice going! It seems you've gained some strength. Oh, nice. All right. Maximum HP increased by 5. Awesome. Well, That's cool. I don't think anything like this happened in previous Persona games. Well, it's getting late. Why don't you go get some sleep? Okay, okay, okay. I wonder what we're gonna do tomorrow with all the free time and all. It'll be interesting to see how people spend the, the, the time, what sort of activities they've been doing. Anyway, I better save now. Okay. Come on, we're going to pawn that medal today. Hey, you can hear me, right? You don't have plans, do you? Come help me out instead of sleeping your life away. We do owe it to him. We just have to wait. Hurry down and help him out. I'd like to save. Anyway, choose the daytime. We're giving him a hand. 
sorry I kind of pressured you into doing this. And now to our next topic, Fall from Grace, the story of a dishonored Olympic medalist. Just recently, a high school coach admitted to high school that he had been perpetually abused. Perpetu oh, my English! What happened to it? That he had been perpetually abusing students. Given his prior Olympic achievements, this has caused quite a stir. What caused this habitual offender to suddenly confess these heinous crimes to his entire school? The police are hoping that the upcoming interrogations will bring light to this question. Up did you hear that bubble that I did when I said oh, uh, upcoming? Up. Anyway. Hmm. Isn't this... My friends who come back from practice with bruises all the time. He was scared but I'm relieved that the abuse is finally going to end now. He would touch me and stuff all the time. And think with the bomb and, and that carrot and you know. I'm glad I don't have to deal with that sexual harassment anymore, especially the carrot. There were always rumors, sure, not many people believed them though. Like, I'm totally shocked they were actually true. At least now I can go to school without worrying. Sorry guys for doing all these stupid voices, but... I kind of can't control myself. I knew it. This is your school, isn't it? Seems like it, yeah? Please. Things might be getting turbulent at school, but you need to just keep your head down, alright? More importantly, keep those hands moving. I've got some more stuff I need you to do. Damn, that's slavery, slavery. <laughs> the chief really worked us hard. Did you see? It was in the news. No way the school's gonna be able to play dumb after that. I saw it too. Shu's name didn't come up, right? Not that I saw. I bet they wanted to keep that part quiet. I'm so glad. It's finally over then. All we gotta do now is hit some tasty shit and pull all this crap behind us. I'm totally looking forward to this celebration party. I'll try that. I'll try not to let you guys down. All right, we need to go sell the gold medal tomorrow. Even if the chief wants your help, make sure you turn him down, okay? Hey, look. It's not easy to turn him down. I'm staying at this place. What do I do? I hold to the people I hold, come on. Make sure to do the dishes. Uh... Can I do it when I get back? Just do it. Don't get cocky with me. Welcome. Oh, wait. Wait a second. I know her. She's size something. She's the uh, prosecutor who is investigating me at the beginning of the game, which is, you know, in the future and because this is all a flashback apparently and what, 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 what's the story how does she know this place am I interrupting something no we're just fighting not at all the cause of the runaway train incident in the subway the other day still has not been found police are hurrying to solve the matter as it may relate to the rise in psychotic breakdown incidents hmm oh is that the thing everyone's been talking about? Doesn't it make you curious? Hmm. People who were living normal lives suddenly went mad or deranged out of the blue. Not to mention that it's happening one after another. Could they really be coincidental? Right. Could they? Hmm. Leaving that aside, what do you have? Hmm. I'll have the house blend, please. Are you a part-timer? I'm surprised this place can afford one. Hey, that you've just offended the owner of the shop that is right in front of you. What is wrong with Japanese people? That, that's exactly they, the case. They tend to say these things without realizing. Maybe it's just the translation, but it's it happened more than once. 
they they're judgmental in front of the people that they are placing a judgment upon and they don't realize that people have feelings and I'm sorry I love Japan and all but sometimes these things happen and I'm like yeah you know what why why are people so rude in this game maybe it's just their characteristics maybe it's just the characterization and the way that the characters has been built in terms of its traits or whatever but that doesn't seem the case to me anyway hey 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 whatever I don't know are you a high school student where do you attend yeah what's it to you bitch Chujin Academy oh someone I know goes there as well mm hmm I've heard that things are rough right now a teacher named Kamoshida confessed his crimes like he was a completely different person, supposedly. And it happened all of a sudden one day. Can a person's mental state change so easily? Huh. <sighs> Is my drink ready yet? Coming right up. Shall we go? All right, today's the day we turn in that metal for cash. You know, some place they'll buy it off, right? That's right, but I like to save. I'll just add this. Right, better to save now. Right, so where do we go to sell this thing? Because in reality, I know a few places, but I'm not quite sure I know it all. do I have? 8,000 yen. Perhaps I could afford a TV. You want to sell me gold metal? I know we handle a bunch of junk here, but the metal isn't really the type of thing we sell. I'm sorry, but I can't buy that off you. Maybe you can try somewhere else? You know, I had a feeling that this place would buy it. Oh! Maybe the airsoft shop will buy that off you. Buy that off you. Let's try going there. That's right. That's the place in Shibuya, right? There's a cinema here, I've never been, but I'd like to go at some point. Nobody chatting around here? So yeah. Nope, I need to go to Shibuya. Central Street, I guess. Beautiful. Let's have a look at books. No time for the tours, you say? Okay. What about the ramen shop? No time for the tours. Okay. So let's go to the... Place. I'm saying something here. This is the place, huh? Looks like it. Ah, oh, looks like it. Let's just take care of this. Wait, we don't have a search warrant yet. Just be patient. I'm sure we'll get one soon enough. I don't even know think about running off down this narrow alley. They're cops? I'm quite amazed at my own, like, Ability to just eavesdrop on conversation of cops and other important people. This month's featured product has such extreme power as the Bianchi's bus. As bus is like a short-range weapon, but it's a strong gun. You again? What do you want? 
point you to buy this. A gold medal? Why do you have this? We don't buy any fake or stolen goods here, kid. Not exactly, let me see it. I know, it's the real deal, right? I'm just not gonna ask where you got this. How is 30,000 yen sound for it, though? It's not enough. No, it's not enough. <laughs> the both of us know you ain't finding another buyer for that thing. Just take the 30,000 grand. Sorry, 30,000 yen. So there you go. I got a lot of money. Here, take this with you. That's a thanks for selling me the model. But best not to open it. Just bring it with you next time you come back here. That's a little weird. Don't worry about it. They're here. Munei Hisaiwai, yes? There are some matters we'd like to discuss with you today. Go, kid. Do you know why you were here? <laughs> I don't know, looking for evidence? You tell me, detective son. What's your attitude? Well, you guys gonna search me? Go on, do what you gotta do. What was that? An upstanding citizen supposed to cooperate with the cops, right? Hey, you sure that lead, you sure that lead was leg legitimate? I could have sworn it was. <laughs> Can you two hurry up? I got a business to run here. You bastard. Hey, you. It's in the back, huh? Show me. That kid's just a regular old customer. You can check the tapes if that will convince you. I'll show you everything that's gone down here. Everything that's gone down here today. I don't want to be here when the de detectives see the, f see the footage of me with that cold metal. I should leave. I won't let you get away that easy. Show us what's in the bag. I should actually be going. <sighs> hmm? Hold this is starting to feel a little too fishy. Hey, you're taking talking to a kid, remember? Besides, it's not the one we're here to see. Huh? That's right, Detective Son. Maybe next time, try not harassing my customers. See how that goes. Huh. <sighs> See ya. Safe trip home, kid. So I think we got him out of the situation. Mm. Just by the skin of our teeth. What were those detectives doing there? More importantly, aren't you curious about what's in the bag? They told us not to look. There's no harm in the little peek. Okay. Come on, let's open it up. You stupid cat, why did you suggest opening Hey, wait! It? Real can wait, I think it's just a model. It's incredible though, miles ahead of the one Brett Yuji had. There's something weird about that place. Hey, hey! Yeah, just had a great idea. We should totally buy this gun for him later. I mean, it's perfect. Something this real looking will work wonders in the metaverse. Anyway, it told you to bring it back to the next, the next time you came, right? Now's our chance! You should try striking a deal with him when we get when we go to return it. All right. So we're gonna magically having added and carried around with us. And it's calling me. Oh, hello, it's me. She got changed. Her clothes are different. I saw the news. You know about Kamoshida? It's getting a lot of coverage. How do you feel? I don't know. The reaction's been bigger than what I was expecting. I guess I'm just surprised. I don't think we did anything wrong, though. I wonder if we helped those people speak, about, speak up about it. I'm sure we did. That's pretty amazing, huh? I didn't think we'd actually be able to do it. And yeah, look at us now. This calls for a celebration. Let's meet in front of Shibuya Station at noon tomorrow. Don't be late. Oh, and did you pawn off the medal? 
You didn't forget, right? My god, if the police is intercepting any of these calls, they would have so much to learn. I remembered. Good to hear. I already made reservations. You should be really excited about the place I chose, by the way. I'm sure everyone's gonna love it. See you guys tomorrow. Okay. <laughs> mm, a restaurant of ladies and choosing. Finally a decent meal. What do you think we're gonna be eating? I'm hoping barbecue. Oh, I could go for some guagyu beef. It better be great, eh? In any case, I'm surely looking forward to it. Okay. Big celebration tomorrow, so let's get some sleep. Anything I can do? Maybe some training? Or maybe some things with the storage? Wow! A huge card box. That's stuff in your that's that's your stuff in there. There isn't much. I can talk to Morgana maybe. Hey, hey. I wonder what the restaurant lady enters for us. I'm still thinking about it. Hey! Where are you going? Where are you going? Tomorrow's the party, you know? So what? Hey! I can't go downstairs. I wanna see the neighbor at night. Hey, hey! Can't I do anything? Hey! Okay, you know what? Let's just leave. Let's do it! Do -do -do -do. Time to celebrate! <laughs> Tomorrow, I can't wait! So good. No wonder Lady An chose this place. Of course it's good. This is a famous hotel after all. It looks proper fancy. Oh yeah. I heard that the police are coming to interview some people at school. That's troublesome. Our names are gonna come up for sure. People are spreading all sorts of rumors about us and Kamoshida. But we got him pumped up. I keep hearing stuff like the Phantom Thieves really stole his heart. <laughs> He's loving the attention. I think most people don't believe it, but some of them actually seem grateful. I know, right? Look at this. The Phantom Aficionado website? Oh, wow, there's a really fandom about them. Well done, Phantom Thieves. Now I can keep going too. Thank you for giving us hope. Pretty cool, huh? I was just desperate to deal with my own problems, but seeing people saying all this feels... strange. Yeah. Hey, what do we do now? What do we do now? Is that... Are we good on time? You planning on eating? Well, of course I'm gonna eat, but... Oh, you were saying in general? <gasps> this place has a time limit! Oh, wow, really? Oh, crap! We only got an hour to eat! Oh, yeah, it's a thing. Just 50 minutes left! Oh, I'm not gonna finish all the beef dishes at this pace! I need to eat my way through the entire dessert menu! Look after our stuff. We'll snag something for you guys too. Don't worry. <laughs> oh man! God melts in my mouth. <laughs> Seriously? Only meat? Now where should I start? In 
she's all about the cake. So happy! <laughs> hey, galleries. Shut up! How much do you think one of these costs? I'll never get the chance to do this again! <laughs> mm, the Wilton Hotel Cake Buffet! I'd heard rumors, but I never thought it'd be so amazing! <laughs> and where's our share? I didn't really know what you'd want. <laughs> so I just grabbed you some beans. <laughs> <laughs> he got him some beans. Beans? There were some pretty bizarre things there too, so we got you a variety of those. Fried bananas, preserved eggs, and some kind of beans. M more beans? We put so much on the plate that it got all mixed up. But it should probably still taste good. <laughs> this is just plain grotesque. Didn't she didn't make a very good job at selling it either. Let's go. These two just don't know what fine dining means. We'll show them. I'll need help, yeah, cause Leave it all to me. Oh god. You guys watch our things while we're gone. Wait patiently for our return. Hmm. Oh, looks like a meaty explosion in my mouth. Oh, this part's cream cheese. They're not even listening. Hi there guys in the chat, how's it going man? As I would expect from this buffet at the top as I would expect from the buffet at the top class hotel. The ingredients and variety of dishes are crazy good. There's a reason it costs 8,000 yen. They have a lot here. A fish should come first. Let's fill up plate with all sorts of fish. Which table do you think they're at? Oh I wish I could use my third eye. Man, there's so much food here. I can't wait. I can't decide what I want. Okay. Let me get it from other people's table. Hmm. Everything is so good. It's basically the cake. Mm. Okay. I bet you like my voice acting. Rice dishes. No. Meat dishes. Salad. Fish. I hope I very raw, but the grill is great too. Have you heard, my dear? The news about that Kamoshida fellow was absolutely dreadful. Oh, right, the teacher is at Shujin Academy. Cut doing such indecent acts. Shameful, really. Hold on a second. And they still haven't managed to solve those horrible psychotic breakdown episodes, have they? I wish they wouldn't let themselves be distracted by such a tawdry scandal. Perhaps it's a sign of how peaceful this country is. I can't see those poor Shijujin students though. Huh, it sounds like the Kamoshida incident is the talk of the town. Hmm? Should they notice you? Just grab some food and act natural. On the plus side, we'll get to eat the food later. How did a child like this end up in here? I certainly hope I didn't bring friends. I prefer my meals to remain hooligan free. Thank you very much. Come on, let's go. What's so bad about kids coming to enjoy a buffet? Hmm. I wonder how the other people here are reacting to the news. Let's get some more food and listen in. Maybe there are more people who can eat drop on at other tables. Is that what the game's about now? How close, it looks even bigger and more delicious. This giant sweet. Oh, I got distracted. News travels quick. It's already all over the, in the internet. You know, the story about how Kamoshida got his ass kicked by some world reforming heroes. It doesn't sound like a serious story to me. Some of the details are pretty far fetched. Don't worry about it, we just have to do what they tell us to do. That's all rumors made up by school kids anyway. If it's gripping news, who cares if it's not true? 
so they don't believe themselves, but they're making up stories to make the phantom thieves seem real. And they're doing this in front of the actual phantom thieves. Hmm? Move back fast and get some food. I make sure we got a lot of whipped cream. What's wrong? Oh, nothing. I thought some weird kid was looking at us, that's all. Why don't we go? It's almost time for the meeting. Wow, that was rude, did you hear? He said you were weird. I wonder how the other people are here are reacting to the news. Let's get some more food and listen in. How, am I, how much food am I cashing in? Hey, it'll be a problem if they figure out where it's dropping. Let's pretend to get some food. There are some meat dishes nearby. Mm. Mm. Okay, okay. Where are the meat dishes? There. Ah, meat. I'm no Yuji, but the meal is just not the same if you don't have any I got distracted. When you really look at it, it's just an ex-athlete who overestimated himself. He should have just accepted his lot in life and quietly done his job as a teacher. It's not even an incident we can take seriously. The whole story is pretty ridiculous. We should probably look into it, but we can also just let the low-ranking scrubs handle it. Look into? I guess they're investigating Kamoshida. They don't sound very enthusiastic about it, though. Hmm? Grab some food and get the part that's not fatty. <laughs> I like it always being very researched and refined in his, you know, QCM tips. He's going to be arriving soon. We don't want to keep him waiting, so we better get going to it. What is he going to discuss with the IHOPs? Well, I'm sure it's more important than lunch. They were dressed quite well, but they still looked pretty shady to me. How the other people here are reacting to the news. Let's get some more food and listen in. Mm -hmm. Rice is incredible. It's the cornerstone of every great meal. Oh, sorry, I got carried away there. So, the ratings for the news were really that good? It was because it was about that teacher which actually arrested the students, huh? Was it Kamoshida? It's all about how you frame it. You've got to cater to the idiotic public. Ratings go up when you show them crude, sensational news and make it easy for them to understand. How can you be so insensitive? A student almost killed herself because of that Kamoshida. By the way, do you think this sudden changes of heart might be real? Well, let's, um... Quick, grab some food. Don't forget the crispy bits. So, because he had a sudden change of heart, he just confessed to all this crime? Huh, who knows? Sorry, but this time I've got to go. I'll call you again after the meeting. Sound a change of art, huh? I suppose I can't blame you for seeing it that way. I don't think there's anyone else we can listen in on. But it's shocking, it's shocking. So many of the adults here don't seem like nice people. Now, according to what we heard, it seems most adults aren't very interested in the news about Kamoshida. Well, now that we've got a nice variety of food on our plates, let's let's head back to the others. It's making me hungry slightly. Oh, oh, you brought a tone back. What do you think about coming up against such ritzy food? Coming up against such ritzy food. I'm so happy. <laughs> Cute hearing that from someone like you. Just don't get too excited, got it? Man. You're the last person while giving advice about that, Ryuji. Wait. Don't you think you're eating too much, Mona? There's no knowing when you'll get to eat come here again. <sighs> sure, but you guys brought back loads of food. He'll be ashamed to let it all go to waste. Why don't you help them out, Ryuji? We should both help. Me, I'm way too stuffed. I couldn't possibly help. Stuffing your face with cake. <laughs> Whatever. Andrea Morgan, let's deal with this ourselves. It feels like no matter how much we eat, the amount of food we have stays the same. Mm. Still more? Don't give up. Let's give it a hit. <sighs> we did it. My belt feels multiple sizes too small. Yeah, 
this is a victory for all of us. That was tough. We won because we did it together. <laughs> Good job, you guys. How about one that's dish to clean the, your palette? Your palettes? Your palates? Palates? Whatever. I recommend the seasonal tart. The great food that's both alluring sweetness and the tangy sourness. Stop, I don't want to hear about sour stuff. But this isn't good, I gotta go to a bathroom. <sighs> me too, please carry me gently. Wait. My, look at that table. They must not normally have the opportunity to eat such exquisite food. I can only imagine what their parents must be like. Huh? What was that? Damn it. We don't got time for that. Come on, let's go. And that was our slice of life, our little moment of social activity together with the rest of the party. I totally panicked when I saw the closed for cleaning sign at the bathroom. <laughs> Lol. You were talking big about eating until you puked, but you really did puke. Are you some kind of moron? Oh man. He really did eat too much. Hey, same goes for you. What floor was that restaurant on? We came up to get here, so it has to be on a lower floor, right? Beaver, who's that bull guy? What the? There's still no update on the case. Distinguished man, I haven't seen this person before. Yeah, this is a first. Is he a cop? Not yet. Excuse me, but why are you so involved? It's not something you should be concerned with. I don't care about your opinion, you incompetent buffoon. When I say pick up the pace, you do it. Hey, you're cutting in line. What do you want? No, my guts need to be at least bold to say that. What do you want? Oh, I can't say it. Gods need to be at least bold to say that. Again, this is a situation where I can't really react the way I'd like. I really now want to work on my courage. I'll make sure to do activities that help me increase my statistics in courage. In guts. We're in a hurry. Oh, I'm sorry. So you can butt in front of other people if you're in a hurry? It seems the customer base has changed since I was here last. Have they started a daycare? What? Sir, we don't have time for this. I know. Don't bother with them. Voice just now. Guy. He seemed to have recognized that voice, the one that said, don't bother with them. Shouldn't we head back down? What voice was he? Sounded a bit like Sojigo, wasn't it? Yeah, but... That dick really pissed me off. He wasn't even hiding the fact that he looks down on everyone. Don't lose your temper over this. I just can't forgive shitty adults like that. That man's boys. Oh, it sounded almost like the one from back then. What's wrong? Yeah, it did sound a bit. It did sound a bit like the guy that uh, got the main character in trouble. Joker, because I mean I was about to say but I didn't say anything because you know I didn't remember that guy to be bold I thought that that guy 
had hair. But yeah, if you go back to the first stream, you can see the cutscene, you can see the flashback. The story is that I am now in Tokyo because I got involved in a... I attacked the person on the street. I only did so in order to intervene because he was harassing this girl. So I tried to help the girl by intervening but pushed him and this person sued me. And now I had to relocate to Tokyo in order to spend the probation here away from home. In order to sort of prove my innocence. I don't know. That doesn't make sense but still that's the whole plot of the game. And that guy who I crossed my path with and that I crossed is is that guy it seemed at least but he looked different that's just gonna make me worry more you know yeah I bet it's because he rarely eats well I'm always stuck with canned cat food too yeah that's sir bullshit makes me sick Damn it! What took you so long? Why are you all pissy? Sorry. I had a run-in with some woman a second ago. You too? She bumped into me, but then said it was all my fault when she dropped her plate. <laughs> Sounds like a real bitch. Yeah. Thanks, though. But the restaurant workers all looked at me with this disapproving expression. I know, adults suck, doesn't it? I wonder if we're out of place here. Maybe. It always feels like this to me. <clears throat> hey, Morgana. What is it? Anyone could have a palace, yeah? Anyone with a strong, distorted desire. Same for them having a change of heart if their treasure gets stolen? That would be the case. Why are you bringing this up all of a sudden? Yeah. We had trouble earlier, too. These selfish shitheads who just look down on everyone else. I was just wondering if we'd be able to change those kinds of people too. You mean, you want to continue as the Phantom Thieves? Like, can you pick your targets? I've been thinking. We put a lot of work into changing Kamoshida's heart, but nobody believes in the Phantom Thieves. Plus, those guys who had no other choice but to just deal with it are thanking us. Us! Of all people! Well, there are a lot of victims. I... I agree. If we ignore people who are in trouble, I'd go back to being the same as I was before. Well, that's true. You're under my tutelage. There's nothing we can't accomplish as phantom thieves. Shouldn't we be able to help him out? I didn't even think of such a possibility. But it's true that with that power, we may be able to help people out. But... That means we'll have to fight shadows again, doesn't it? Indeed, that can't be avoided. Eh, I'm sure we'll manage. <laughs> right? Even if you guys are still just fledglings, this means we're an actual organization now. And criminals. Fledglings? <laughs> That's actually pretty fitting for us. All right, it's settled. We're gonna catch all these shitty adults by surprise and make ourselves known to the world. Are you okay being our leader?
Yeah, why? No objections here? I can't handle all that responsibility stuff. Where's my say in this? But Lady Ahn made the recommendation, so I'll allow it. Well, should we decide on a name for our group? Yeah, I just went with Phantom Thieves of Hearts last time, but don't you think a real name would be cooler? Oh, wow. Need to go with a real name? I want it to be something both cute and luxurious sounding. Let me see. How about the diamonds? <laughs> I'm getting the real Little League baseball feel from it. Yeah. Well then, here's my suggestion. How about Tilefish Poilet? That's not even pronounceable easily. Tile... uh... what? That's what I ate earlier. It's commemorative, no? Oh. Oh no, you idiot! Uh, you decide for us. Your team name may be seen by others when using network services. Please be cautious not to enter any personal information. Furthermore, please do not enter a name that could be considered offensive. Ooh, cool. Okay, we'll, we'll name the whip it in. Phantoms. Ah, I don't know. I don't know. What do I what do I put? A name for the group. How about that? That should work. Hmm. I don't know. Let me try with some lame name, like Degenerates. That doesn't fit. What do I, what do I call them? Hmm. Name for the group, well... Maybe I can try and do it like this. Hmm. 
Yeah, how about this? I suppose this should be funny. I wish there were more characters. I've got to be honest. Let's go. I don't think it's that important anyway. Huh. That's not bad at all. And now they just agree magically. A good name for a rookie. Sake of the <laughs> Diogo, too late. I haven't seen that any earlier because otherwise I would. How are you doing, man? We going with that? Well, now that the name's set, who's our next target? Trophy unlocked. There are tons of rotten adults and all. Why not just stick to targeting big names? Like a celebrity? Like a CEO? Yeah, something along those lines. If we go after some bigwig, it's gotta get on the news, right? That's right. But you don't want to do this for popularity only. Don't you think more people would believe in us if we did that? That's not a bad idea. For you, Ryuji. Wait, wait, what is the whole point of this thing? Are we just doing it for this fame? True. If we become better known, we might be able to give courage to a lot more people. I don't really like the idea of just picking someone out of the blue, though. Yeah. Let's narrow it down to someone we can all agree on, then. Hmm. So we need a big wig we decide on unanimously. I like that unanimous decision part. It's like we're making some kind of pact. Now then, this is the official formation of the Phantom Thieves organization. Time for the buffet ran out. I guess we'll just have to talk more tomorrow. And there we are. Back in the inter in the interrogation room. Another world in which people's distorted cognitions take shape? Stealing treasure to change hearts? And on top of that, a talking cat told you all this. So true. Honestly speaking, that all sounds absurd. It's hard to believe that this is even worth listening to. Still, it can't be considered nonsense when parts of it align with Kamoshida's confession. The same goes for the testimonies of the officers who arrested you. But so be it. At any rate, you mentioned something more important. Which is? These two other accomplices, besides this talking cat thing that appeared in your story. From what you've been telling me, they're students at the same school, aren't they? I'm not answering. Very well, I'll leave it at that. Let's continue on. Oh, really? That's a real village call like that? Really, Diogo? There are many more events that I must inquire on. Lies and false accounts are eventually exposed. The next to receive a calling card was this individual. What? This is my next target already? What did he do? A master of Japanese arts, Ichiryusai Matarame. It's even more incomprehensible than Kamoshida as to why this man was targeted. Where did you come to know him? And how did you learn of his crimes when you weren't a victim of them? Start by telling me what you all schemed. Whoa. The summary of the story up to this point has been updated. To read, press the triangle button to open the menu, then select Story from under the System option. 
Well, it seems that we have now closed the first chapter, so to speak, of the game. Well, we spent all our money on the buffet, but we officially established the Phantom Thieves, so it was totally worth it. Wow, spent the ton. Phantom Thieves, huh? I'm liking the sound of that. I hope we can really help people. I'm curious about that Phantom Aficionado website too. I wonder who made it. No clue. Oh, importantly, you see the survey on there? I don't know how I feel about it. Yeah, there was this approval rating thing, but it was only at like 6%. That's low. Seriously. But don't you just want to get, get it higher than that? I bet it'll go up tons if we keep taking down big targets. It's pretty damn exciting if you try and think about it like that. You know, you're actually right. Well then, let's keep working out from this point on. I don't like where this is going. These guys are really losing the plot and trying to make this a fame game. And I don't know, that doesn't really, as a motive, resonate with me. In any case, we have sort of, I believe we have completed now a first part of the game, the first chapter. And we understood the main mechanics, but everything is going to make a lot more sense as we go over and over into the pattern, in and out, in and out again of palaces. I believe that's what's going to happen next. We already had a sneak preview, sneak peek of of the next target. I haven't recognized him, I don't think we've met him yet, but that's probably what we're going to see from now on. And that's going to happen tomorrow in the next stream, in the next video. Part of the playlist here. I'm gonna stop the stream for now. Let's do it. Make sure I save. And I thank you all guys for watching and for hanging out. Thanks a lot for tuning in, guys. I'll be streaming again tomorrow, possibly tomorrow.